Hey boys and girls, welcome to another super exciting, outrageous toy review. Today, my friend Paul and I are looking through Hi, a boys and girls. big box of G.I. Joe stuff I bought at a flea market. I was at a flea market in New Jersey, and I saw a 90s Millennium Falcon, like, destroyed at a, at a table. I went over looking, and I started rooting through this box, and some other guys started rooting through it. So I just said, how much for the box? And bought it, because I didn't want to have to deal with somebody grabbing the yeah, stuff I was trying I to get. People do that. So I just bought the whole box. And I know there's a couple good parts, but I don't know how complete anything is because I didn't really look through it all the way. Just kind of bought Just it. Just kind of bought it. Truck. So uh, we're going to set it on the floor and start putting stuff up on the table and taking a look at it. Cool. All right. First up, I see a Stinger Jeep. This is a Cobra vehicle. It is missing its missiles here. And no steering wheel, but it's got its little doors and its uh, roof. What do you got there, Paul? Um... I'm totally drawing a blank on the name. It's like the... The sound best. of the snake makes. Yeah, it's a hiss yeah. tank. Yeah, there you go. That's missing its cannon, uh, but it does have its canopy. Pretty dirty. Can you clean those? Yeah, okay. you can. There's, a, there's like a polish you can use on the windshields and stuff. Uh, classic Cobra vehicle. Yeah, I love the hiss tank. I found a vamp Jeep. Ooh, this one's in pretty rough shape. Another Stinger Jeep. Missing a door. It's like a Jeep collection here. Does it have a steering wheel? No. No steering wheel. All right. Here we've got another vamp. This one actually, the roll cage is in good shape. No steering wheel. Both of these are missing a cat that goes on the back as well as some gas cans. I got two of these guys. Ooh, the ASP. This is a like towable gun station. You can actually put this on the back of the Hiss tank. All the G.I. Joe Cobra vehicles have a little tow hook on them. Okay. So you can pull things around. Another stinger. Mm -hmm. got Anything there? There's a piece of something. Hmm. Uh, that's the that's the push bar. It's like the goes on the front bumper oh, okay. of a stinger. We got a missile in there. This is the Dreadnought Swamp Fire. This is in pretty rough shape. This is a helicopter. It's supposed to have pontoons so it can land on water. And it changes color in sunlight. Got another dirty his tank. A dirty his tank. I'm starting to think maybe this was parted out. Somebody has robbed these things apart. So you think it's just a beat up collection? This was not a kid's collection. It doesn't seem like because too many no. repeat vehicles. Yeah, no kid would have a bunch of the same thing. Here's the Wolverine. This was um, Cover Girl's tank from GI Joe. This actually is in pretty good shape, other than it's missing you know the missiles and the tow cable. But it's actually clean and has nice stickers on it and everything. Okay, we got a steering wheel. Ooh, a steering wheel. I know there was at least one steering wheel because I saw a steering wheel when I was looking through it when the guy started grabbing it and stuff, and I was like, you know what? Steering wheels are really hard to find for those old vehicles, and I was going to grab the box, and I hope there were several of them in here. <laughs> we got a paint stirrer. Oh, good. That's so worth money. Case. Buy that today. <laughs> Here's a, uh, a really destroyed vamp. What is that? I... I don't know. I was going to ask you. You think that's from like RoboForce or something? I can't remember find that it. Max Steel robot. Guy? Yeah, I can't find a marking on it at all. Wow, that's strange. It's a piece of something. I'm trying to figure out which. I guess the guy sat in here, and then this. So this is the bottom. And this looks like a trigger or something. Yeah, to trigger. That, something. Which was probably something in here. That's weird. I don't know what that's to. Yeah, and if you don't know, nobody. No one will comment below if you know. Yeah, comment Make below. Make me look dumb. Call Rob Bruce. <laughs> Here's a uh, piece to a Mack truck. <laughs> uh, some other G.I. Joe pieces. That's part of the bivouac. We got some road. Road? <laughs> Where we're going, we don't need roads. Oh, this is one of the Star Wars mini rigs. Oh, yeah, the, the sand skiff. The sand skiff. There's the plank for Luke to walk yeah. out on. That's cool. Here's a destroyed ass. Another ass. Here you go, Kevin. Oh, dragonfly. Kids. Jump pack table. That's the G.I. Joe jetpack launch pad. Star Wars gun. Yeah, it's the X-Wing fighter gun. Oh, Kevin. What'd you find? Ram motorcycle, my favorite G.I. Joe vehicle of all times. Wow. And here's another one. And another one. That's good. That's why you bought the box. Yeah, I don't, bought it. Two mind. rams. Here's a recon sled, one of the worst G.I. Joe vehicles. Another his tank missing. No turret. Everything. This is the base to the whirlwind. This is a double-barreled cannon that could be towed behind vehicles. 
knockoff figure. He has a Remco, yeah, like Sergeant Rock figure. Or something like that. Uh, lid to a can. Hulk Hogan's leg. Nice. <laughs> There's a rotor blade to the dragonfly. There's a gun to the dragonfly. Legs for an 82, 83 guy. I yeah, because they're uh, rock and roll, maybe. I forget who has the black pouches on his pants. Maybe Breaker. Uh, truck piece. Another piece to the jump jetpack launch pad. Some more road. Hey, Paul, I found the perfect thing for you. Here's a grinder bit you can put in your drill so you can sharpen your lawnmower blade. Sweet. Glad that's in a box of kid toys. Sealed Hobgoblin. Oh, from McDonald's. well, there makes the whole set worth it. <laughs> this is the back to a space shuttle toy. There's the jets. I'm finding the rest of the G.I. Joe guy. Here's his crotch, his helmet. Hey, an unbroken 82 or 83 crotch is good. It's 83. I got Darth Vader. Wait, you can tell by the crotch? Yeah, the, the centerpiece was thicker on the 82 guys. Okay. Are those G.I. Joe? What? Like high heel legs? I do I don't think so. <laughs> they're, they're um the dude in the Hawaiian shirt. Chuckles? <laughs> they're chuckles. I they might be like uh Buck Rogers or somebody. Are they Robotech? Because this looks like Robotech. Maybe that might be what it is. I think they're Robotech. Robotech legs. So maybe that's Robotech. Maybe, maybe or yeah, I think you said that. Killer whale part. There's a handful more. Killer whale oh. part. Hey, it's the Corgi Batmobile from the 60s. Oh, that's and It's cool. actually in better shape than the one I had as a kid. Here's... I think that's a Cylon leg or something like that. C-3PO's arm. Here's the steering wheel. Transformer gun. Ooh. Oh, that's to um, uh, laser beak. Laser beak? Yeah. Okay. Not sure. Here's a brooch. Oh, good. Getting my money's back now. Here's some broken pieces to the vamps. Oh, this is a missile launcher for one of the jets from yeah. Transformers. Havoc part and um, Skyhawk. C-3PO's arm. C-3PO's arm. Is that the removable or non-removable one? I don't know. Yeah, it's the removable one. So it's not broken. Man weapon. Yeah, Mechanex club. Some tr tank treads to a G.I. Joe vehicle. Mask? Yeah, I think so. Maybe the vampire? Yeah. More odds and ends. Little little accessories to G.I. Joe's. I don't, anything else really exciting in there? Oh. A uh, compass. Nice. Found another steering wheel. It's good. Hard to find part. Metal Trip wires. Detector. Wires metal detector. Lego steering wheel. Oh, a puffy pen. A puffy pen. <laughs> <laughs> that should be the thumbnail for this video. I found Stalker's back. Kevin's shoe. <laughs> that be That's out. pretty much it. Yeah. Little bits of broken junk in the bottom there. Buttons and stuff, but. That's about it. All right, so, I don't know. Eh, it might have been worth it. It's not an amazing lot. I didn't get anything. I was hoping there were some really good parts on the bottom. But a couple steering wheels are good. That helped me complete some vehicles. Two Rams. Yeah, which I mean, that's now great you have for like me. 72 of them. This one has a kickstand still. And one saddle bag, so that's exciting. So that's good. Some Someday I'm going to make a video about all my Rams. Someday. Sure. i got to get them all in one place first. Yeah. i got to find them all. All right, well, thanks for watching this super exciting, outrageous toy review. In the comments below, let us know if you'd like to see more of these collection sorts. Make sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos. And send Kevin your Rams. <laughs>